Hi children, today we are going to start a new lesson uh, in our maths workbook, page number 36. Uh, now, let's see what this lesson is about. Look at this crocodile. It is very, very hungry. Its mouth is open wide. So, you can see the picture where his mouth is open wide. So, what are they saying? That he is very hungry. It has now caught a fish. But its mouth is still open. So even though he has eaten a fish, still his mouth is open. It wants more and more fish to eat. Look at the shape of its mouth. So what are they saying? That he wants more and more to eat. Even though he eats, he wants more and more. Now look at the shape of its mouth. Can you see the shape of its mouth? Yes. Okay. We use this shape in maths as a sign or symbol. So, what are they saying? That we use this shape as a sign or symbol. It tells us which number is bigger or greater and which number is smaller or less. So, they have used this picture of a crocodile, the shape of its mouth, uh, to show us this symbol. No, it's a symbol. So, this, so, what are they saying? In this symbol, it shows us which number is bigger, greater, smaller or less. Right, now let's go to page number 37. Greater than or less than? Greater than or less than is the lesson. So, you can see. So, let's see what the lesson tells us. The crocodile has caught some fish. How many? So let's see. There is one, two, three, four. He has caught four fish. He has two fish here. That means he has two fish in his stomach. And he has four fish here where his mouth is open wide. So, what are they saying in the first picture? He's already eaten two fish and he's eaten another four fish. Okay, let's go to the next one. Which number is bigger or greater? Four is bigger or greater than two? Now, they're asking us this question, no? Because they're asking us whether uh, four or two is bigger or greater. So, four or two is bigger or greater? 4 is greater, no? Or 4 is bigger than 2, right? 4 is more than 2. So, you can see the sign that they have put. The crocodile's mouth opens towards the bigger number. You can see, no? The crocodile's mouth is open towards the bigger number. It's open towards 4. Let's go to the next one. Which number is smaller or less? 2 is smaller or less than? Now, first they have given us 2 and then they have given us 4. So, they are asking us which number is smaller or less. 2 is smaller or less than 4. So, we know 2 is smaller or less than 4, isn't it? 2 is a smaller number. So, you will see the crocodile's mouth open towards the 4. So, you can see that it can be either this way or the other way. So, always the crocodile's mouth is open towards the greater number. Remember, the crocodile always wants lots more. His wide open mouth is always towards the greater number. Right, like I explained to you, always the crocodile's mouth will open towards the bigger number or the greater number because he's always hungry. So, this is the sign. Okay, children. Right, now let's go to page number 38. Now, they have given us numbers. No, now we have to know what number is greater. Because if we take uh, from 1 to 10 or from 1 to 20, we should know what are the bigger numbers. When we start counting, we know when we go on, those become the bigger numbers. So, now they have given us 8 and 6. 8 and 6. So, you can see the crocodile's mouth is open towards the 8. Because 8 is the is a greater number. No, 8 is greater than 6. So, below that you can see they have written 8 is greater than 6. Then they have given us 5 and 6. 5 and 6. Now, 5 is less than 6. No, we know 5 is less than 6. So, it is written here 5 is less than 6. And the crocodile's mouth is open towards the 6. Then we go to 3 and 1. 3 and 1. Now, we can see the crocodile's mouth is open towards 3. Like I explained to you before, always the crocodile's mouth will be open towards the bigger or greater number. So, in the box they have written, 3 is greater than 1. 3 is greater than 1. Okay, children. So, this is the lesson. Remember that always the crocodile's mouth is 
open towards the bigger number okay right now they want us to do the following questions fill in the missing word fill in the missing word okay so they have uh, this are done the uh, sums for us they want us to fill in the missing word so seven and six so you can see that the crocodile's mouth is open towards seven so seven is greater than six so what is the word you will fill in the blank seven is greater than six okay then we go to the next one one and eight one and eight right now you will see now this in my book there is a bit of a mistake i don't know about your book but uh, the uh, the crocodile's mouth is open towards the one it should be open towards the eight okay so we will write there one is less than eight one is less than eight so one is less or smaller than eight okay children then we'll go to the next one three and four three and four now there again i don't know whether uh, but this mistake is in your book in mine uh, the crocodile's mouth is open towards the three but it should be open towards the four because four is a uh, is a bigger number right now in the box we have to fill in the missing word so three is less than four no we know three is less than four so we will write the word less then five and four five and four you can see the crocodile's mouth or the symbol is open towards the five so then five is greater than four five is greater than four so we know when the crocodile's mouth is open towards the bigger number that that is the bigger number or the greater number right nine and eight nine and eight so you can see that the mouth is open towards the nine no so nine is greater than eight nine is greater than eight then we go to the next one six and seven six and seven so they are the crocodile's mouth here again there is a little bit of a mistake because the crocodile's mouth is open towards the six but actually it should be open towards the seven so uh, six is less than seven no six is less than seven because we see that when the crocodile's mouth is open towards the number that is the greater number no that is the greater number so in this the crocodile's mouth should be open towards the seven so six is less than seven okay children so this is uh, how we did the first one now we are going to the second part that they want us to do fill in the missing symbol fill in the missing symbol now the first one has been done for us 8 and 9 8 and 9 okay now to which side do you think uh, the the mouth should be open or the symbol has to turn it should be towards 9 no now here again there is a little bit of a mistake it's open towards 8 but it should be open towards 9 because always remember the crocodile's mouth is always open towards the greater or the bigger number okay children so then we have 5 and 1 you have to see what is the bigger number so i won't give you the answer for all of this if you have understood the lesson you should be able to fill in the blank so look at the two numbers 5 and 1 between 5 and 1 see what is the bigger or greater number and the crocodile's mouth should be open towards the bigger number then 3 and 5 then 8 and 5 4 and 2 6 and 9 6 and 7 9 and 1 and 10 and 2 so always uh, like i explained the mouth can open to either side but it's always open towards the bigger or greater number Okay children so this is the lesson for today we see in the next couple of pages we will uh, learn this greater than or less than this is a very important lesson because you need it for your other grades and uh, when we have an exam this will be a part of your exam uh, so uh, understand this lesson well remember that they use the sign of the crocodile's mouth to show that the mouth is always open towards the bigger or greater number Okay children till I see you next bye